Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to fix Valorant if it says graphics driver crashed error. Okay. So first up, let's just go ahead and uh, open up the NVIDIA app if you have it. Okay. Open it up. Once done, go to the drivers tab and click on update. Okay. If it doesn't need an update, well, try to reinstall it at least. Okay. Once that's done, go ahead and close this one and check Valorant if it helps. If you don't have NVIDIA control panel right here, just go ahead over to your search bar and type in device manager. Click on it to open it up. Now in here, go ahead and find display adapters. Click on your graphics card, right click on it and click on update. In here, just click on browse my computer for drivers. Now go ahead and click on let me pick from a list. Now in here, go ahead and find your GPU and then just hit on next and follow the installation prompts. Okay, once done, don't run the game yet. Go ahead and go to your search bar, type in percent local app data percent okay again percent local app data percent and once that's done just hit on enter wait for it to load once it loads go ahead and find the valorant folder right here double click on it go ahead and double click on saved and then config okay in here click on report client right click on it and then hit on delete once done go back Click on web cache, go ahead and press control A on your keyboard to select all. Once done, right click and then hit on delete. Okay, close this one. And once done, go ahead and right click on a blank space on your screen. Click on show more, open up an NVIDIA control panel. If you can't find it right here, go ahead and go to your search bar and type in NVIDIA. Here we have control panel, just click on it. Wait for it to open. And once it's opened, go ahead over to manage 3D settings, okay? In here, make sure that you are under the global settings. Now in here, just go ahead and make sure to click on restore. Okay, once done, wait for it. And after that, go ahead over to configure surround physics and then click on under processor. Make sure that you select your graphics card. Okay, once done, just hit on apply and do okay. After that, go ahead and restart the computer. Once done, go ahead and launch Valorant and it should work now. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.